taking a quick look back at the win at Bolton last weekend and just wonder just how good was it to go to a club like Bolton and get get the result we needed uh, going into this weekend's final round of fixtures? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, as you say, the main thing is we got the three points um, that we so desperately needed. Um, I think if we didn't win that game, then it would have been, you know, near enough impossible to get into the playoffs. Um, but, you know, we are fortunate to do that. A great ball in from Jack, uh, lovely finish from Sweens. And um, as you say, like, what a place to do it as well. I mean, we've seen outside the stadium that the fans were there, they were they were chanting, singing songs, and they were expecting promotion. And, uh, you know, we went and ruined the party, um, which was good for us. Lovely to spoil the party, wasn't it? It was brilliant, brilliant for yeah. us. We also heard a rumour that the manager now owes you a, a, all a few quid. Um, just wondering, is he paid up yet or is he going to go double or quits for Saturday? He did, yeah. We we had a little team bonding session through the day on Sunday um, and he, to be fair, he stuck to his word and he gave us the uh, the winnings from, from, from the bet that he made with us uh, for the Sunday. So um, he stuck to his word. Fair play. Get on. Get on. Fair play to the gaffer. We'll, we'll, now we'll come back to the Barrow game um, in a minute. But I just wanted to uh, ask you, so how different has this season been to other seasons with the condensed fixtures, the COVID guidelines, the absence of fans? I mean, in short, how weird has it been? Oh, it's been, I mean, it's been so weird, yeah. Um, for me, the biggest what, biggest one was Wembley when we played there last season, end of last season, obviously the playoff final and there was no fans. But, you know, I think I think now it's we're at a stage where we've kind of, um, you know, not got used to it, but you know, we turned up, we know there's not going to be any fans there. We've got to create our own atmosphere. Um, but, you know, when we got, when we got, went through the stage of a couple of games where we had fans in, which was, I think it was December time, um, the Tramier game, which springs to mind, um, it was, you know, a huge lift for every one of us. Um, I think it gave us that extra, you know, spring in our step, each and every one of us. And, um, we know, we just can't wait for the fans to be back. I mean, the old cliche, there's, the football's nothing without the fans. And, um, I just, you know, looking forward to that day where we can have them back. How important, we talked about momentum there briefly, how important is it to go into that Barrow game uh, in a positive frame of mind and, and kind of with a conviction that you're going to get the job done? Oh, massive. Yeah, I mean, if if we'd have been on the back of the three, three draws like we were a few weeks ago, it would have been a bit different. But with us winning the the way the manner we did against Grimsby um, and and the manner we did against Bolton, it gives us huge momentum um, going into Saturday. Um, obviously, we know they're safe, but but that's irrelevant. We're gonna all all the prep's gonna be about us and what we're gonna do and how good we're gonna go about the game. Um, we're gonna give it. Obviously, we're gonna give it our absolute all. And myself and um, all the other lads make a promise that you know we're gonna need nothing out there. Um, and see where we come uh, come five o'clock Saturday. <laughs> 